I wear the mask in order to protect this city. But when faced with a new breed of criminals calling themselves the Pact, the direct approach was met with disaster. I had to don a different mask. As Bruce Wayne, I infiltrated their ranks. The plan was to get in, set the trap, and get out. But the plan failed. Now they're one step closer to their goal. And all I have are questions. What is the pact really after? Why steal Riddler's body? Friend or foe? Nice place you got here. Did it come with the vermin? Or did you add that yourselves? This everyone? Riddler mentioned Harley. Miss Quinn is otherwise occupied. Our crossing the river stinks. We are the entirety of our cabal at the moment. Oh, this gentleman was someone we picked up after Riddler's departure. Bruce Wayne. Bruce, was it? Charmed. Be gentle. This is Mr. Wayne's first foray into the field of felonry. We've actually crossed paths. How? I may have stolen a thing or two from Mr. Wayne. He has so much, I just didn't think he'd notice. Enough pleasantries. You have the device? Excellent. Harley said your gems were in her safe. If she fails to return, you can pester John. He knows the code. It's fine. We can start. Well, let's get to... What are we doing? Well, we're going to... extricate the body. Riddler built a secret back door into the security system of his old employer. I need to scan his eyes and then create a retinal key for them. Then I'll use the key to make goggles, and we can open whatever doors he could. Help me lift. This wasn't the original plan. He was supposed to be alive, but... Things change. Get his head in a good position. That's far enough. Dig the plates under his lids. Press the button and scan away. Ugh, that's gross. did they do to him? And what's with the refrigerator coffin? Why would the agency transport him like this? This doesn't add up, Bruce. Bruce, I'm sorry about Lucius. I'm guessing it wasn't a gas leak or whatever the news said. You're right. Riddler killed him. But it was meant for me. Damn it, Bruce. I'm... This isn't all on you. On to the next. I didn't know what I'd be walking into with this group, but I certainly didn't expect it to involve you. And I know you're no stranger to peril, but you shouldn't be here. So, what gives? No one told me you would be joining us either. Can't say I'm surprised. Not everyone here is happy to see me. I knew Riddler before this. He was the one who initially hired me. And he wound up dead, so... I'm not sure I have a lot of friends here. You're not the only one with questions. One question. Make it fast. How did you get involved with these psychopaths? Ran into Harley once or twice, but I knew Riddler. He tried to bring me in before... Well, before someone here probably killed him. <sighs> Have we concluded? Two eyes in the can. 
Excellent work. Then we can... She's back! and I was here. I was on my way. Well, I was getting to get on my way. Look, I, I put on shoes. Oh, thanks, Puddin'. You would have had a blast if you were with me. Mm. And how about this one? Did you miss me, sugar? Of course I did, Harley. You're pure light. One thing I don't get, though, maybe I'm sick, but if you missed me, why the hell did you leave me behind? Since Big Bad Bane's plan almost got one of our most valuable members killed today, we're having a change in management. What the hell? So speak up if there are any objections. We can hash this out in a reasonable manner. Hurry! Oh, this one's actually got some brains. <laughs> Everyone else better be smart, too. You! <laughs> uh, uh, uh. You are a means to an end when this is over. Did it occur to any one of you people that the job we just pulled went sideways a little too quick? I think they knew we were coming. Because a little rat told him. Bane was right to beat up his guy before we left to hit the convoy. He just beat up the wrong one. Since he couldn't deliver, I'm taking over the case. And I'm not gonna let whoever it is stop me from getting what I want. This leak, it almost got me killed. So now, no one moves, no one breathes without my say-so. Cause I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. And whoever it is, is gonna find their insides suddenly all fresco. That make you nervous, Bruce? What do you have to say? Careful, Bruce. You're valuable, but not irreplaceable. Remember that. Stop waiting! Excuse me, peanut gallery? You got something to say? Wayne pulled his own out there. Saw it with my own two eyes. I ain't gonna let a good effort go unnoticed. Then, let's get back to work! If anyone else has any issues with the New World Order, my door is always open. <laughs> Lead us to our prize, and all will be forgiven. Wayne, come here a second. Thanks for vouching back there. Hey, it's tough in the trenches. We gotta look out for one another. Otherwise... Hiya, Bruce. Guess you're clear. For now. Because apparently you're so capable. I got an errand for you. I know just about everything about Riddler's plan. But he kept one card close to his chest. The location of the job. Took the secret to his grave. Now, I got his laptop, but look at this, and keep your yap shut. Can't let any of these mooks sense weakness. It's encrypted! It's like he knew not to trust any of us. <laughs> Go figure. Okay, let me see the laptop. I'm pretty tech-savvy, maybe I can crack Bruce, it. Bruce, in case you missed it, we have a mole problem. And until we clear that up, the keys to the kingdom stay with me. 
Got it? Riddler had a beef with his former employers, who were cooking up some very dangerous and super fun stuff at a black site lab somewhere here in Gotham. And what is it we're after, this super fun stuff? You ask a lot of questions, you know that? I've been able to piece together most of his plan, except where the black site is. You're gonna find the location. And when you do, maybe you'll get a treat. A sweet, delicious little treat. Sounds enticing. I like treats. Then get on out of here and earn it. See, I ain't letting this laptop out of my sight until I clear up this mole problem. So, I want you to head over to Riddler's place and do some digging. I might need some help. That place is full of death traps. Take John with you. Just don't get him hurt. That's my job. Road trip? With Bruce? I mean... Actually, I was thinking Catwoman. After all, she knew him. Hmm. Good point. Take it too. I'll grab some snacks. <laughs> What's that guy's story? Cat lady, are you more of a beef jerky or trumpet-shaped corn bites girl? Well, there's never a dull moment with John around. Why do I get the feeling that's not a good thing? <laughs> Who's ready to hit the road? Who are you gonna tell if you see anything that ain't on the up and up? You, Harley. But don't worry, Bruce is my best friend. He'd never betray me. Oh, sweet, innocent Puddin. Friends have the easiest access to stab you in the back. Now get out of here. I call shotgun. I want that black site location. I can't believe this is where he decided to set up shop. It wasn't like him to slum it. I always thought the abandoned water tower was an odd choice. I mean, the mold risk alone. We should check for traps. Who knows what Riddler did to this place? On it. Come on, John. Glad you answered. We need to talk. Listen about the convoy. We couldn't get to you safely. The EMP blast knocked out my ability to communicate with my field agents. I'm sorry. It obviously wasn't supposed to go down like that. Harley's crew is a threat, and they are moving fast. Towards what? Do you know what their end goal is yet? No. No one's talking. Bruce, you are the best chance of figuring out what that is. Well, now they have Riddler's body. It was cryogenically frozen. By the agency. Bruce, this was a 60-year-old man who went toe-to-toe -to -toe with Batman. I have some very interested researchers who wanted to see what kept him ticking. Wait, wait, uh, I got the punchline wrong. Uh, let me start. It's fine, John. Riddler's eyes. They're a key to a door that lies somewhere in Gotham. And Harley doesn't know the location. She asked me to find it. Stay put for now and maintain your cover at all costs. This is our chance to get ahead of this train. So I say, Doc, I'll have what she's having. <laughs> <laughs> it was a good thing we searched around. I noticed an old security camera and deactivated it. No telling what will come across inside. Okay, let's find a way in. Just have to get through these boards. Don't worry. I brought my key. Ooh. 
Let me give it a shot. Okay. Share and share alike is what I always say. Guilty is charged. Want to explain what you're doing out here? This isn't exactly the heights. Uh, this isn't what it looks like. It looks like you're trying to break into a crime scene. Uh, oh, oh, okay. Detective... Bullock. Detective Bullock, right. Uh, look, there's... Actually, a very good reason for all of this. Stay right there, jerkwad. I'm calling this in. I've been asked to report any suspicious activity around here, and you're acting suspicious. Listen to me, you do that, and you'll be ending your career. I'll take my chances. Bruce freaking Wayne. Unbelievable. Wouldn't even be working tonight if I didn't need the extra dough. Maybe this will make me look good with the boss. Wow! You have dynamite in those fists, Bruce? <laughs> that was wonderful! Can we wake him up so Bruce can do that again? No, John. Let's go. He won't be out for long. Come on. Let's get moving. a little warmth. Huh, sounds like you knew a very different Riddler than the one I met. I wish he'd never come back to Gotham. Me too. Look, there's no sense in fooling yourself. People are who they are. Cherry worldview. Someone once told me I was nothing more than a thief. I guess that's all I'll ever be. You knew him best. Where do you think he'd keep any info on what we're after? Well, not to state the obvious, but... It's probably behind a riddle or a puzzle somewhere. Oh, I call the downstairs bed! <laughs> Careful, John. This place is probably a death trap. Follow him, Bruce. I don't want John's curiosity to get us killed. I'm getting really tempted to touch something! <laughs> How many TVs does one guy need? Probably afraid he'd miss something. Handcart? Wonder what he was moving. Hey, Bruce! You have? I don't like how cozy Catwoman was with Riddler. Because he was a killer? Because he was rude to me! We need to stick together. I don't trust this kitten one bit. You know what they say about a black cat crossing your path. Don't worry, I can handle her. Oh, really? I'm Bruce Wayne. I deal with women like her all the time.
You gotta admire the ingenuity. It's a wonderful toy. It's a wonderful way to lose your hand. Well, you know what they say. Curiosity killed the cat. There's something under here. Some kind of platform. Let me help you out there, Bruce. I don't want you to bend your cover bow. inevitably follows. You have to work hard and sleep hard in order to earn your way six feet under. What did I tell you? I suppose those are our clues to whatever Riddler is hiding in here. Work, sleep, death. A little grim. A little boring is what it is. shoes. He didn't exactly have great fashion sense. Well, he did say something about a foot. I take you by night, by day take you back. None suffer to have me, but do from my lack. <laughs> that sounds positive. Riddler's bed couldn't look less comfortable if he tried. Canned food. And lots of it. We can't all get lobster thermidor on a whim. Sure proud of his exploits, wasn't he? understand my mind you must first walk a mile in my well certainly you know the rest be careful what you said on those this is my city this is my plan nobody will interfere is an electrical death cage. If these start sending out energy, we'll all fry.
this is where he built his boxes. I've been meaning to ask it. The green hair, what what is what is that? I don't know, what's with your black hair? I'm sorry, buddy. I'm, I'm a little sensitive about my style. Well, I didn't mean to make you uncomfortable. I don't remember anything about myself before Arkham, and when I came to. Well, here it was. I guess it's natural. Why do you hate Riddler so much? I've mentioned this before, but uh, he always interrupted me. Never let me get to the punchline. It takes a lot of confidence to tell a joke, you know. Made me look like an idiot in front of Harley. And those other guys. But hey, uh, I guess I have the last laugh now. <laughs> John, we're friends, right? So I gotta ask, what do you see in Harley? A ruthlessness. The way her accent comes and goes when she's mad. The way she lets things escalate into violence. <laughs> Looks like you've got both feet in the grave. You hear that? It's like you're standing on an elevator. I bet whatever we're looking for is down there. Maybe someone should stay up here. Keep watch. Good point. Let's go, Bruce. Sorry, cat lady. Or maybe... You could stay? Oh no! Harley gave me an assignment, and I mean to fulfill it. Uh, John, could you give us a moment? Uh oh. <laughs> yeah, gotcha! Something. Charming and unnerving at the same time. So, now that we have a moment, care to fill me in? Care to tell me the real reason you're doing this? Out with it, Bruce. What's going on? I'm undercover. For yourself? <laughs> Isn't Bruce Wayne kind of always undercover? Or is it the other way around? No, yes, I'm undercover working with a group called the Agency. Let me get this straight. You're partnered up with someone? I hope they meet your high moral standard. I didn't come back to Gotham to start up this dance again. But seeing as how both our lives are on the line, let's try to be professional. We can work together. For now. If we have to. You think I wanted this? Any of this? I'm doing what I have to to... To stop these maniacs. That's the job. Yeah, me too. On the clock. So, so good. Now things don't have to be awkward. Now it's my turn. Why are you here? You're not really in bed with this pact. And what if I am? Maybe I need the money. Maybe I don't. Who knows? The world's a complicated place. Then you're going down. Same as them. Remind me what happened the last time you tried to take me down. I don't think we need to go through that again. Yoo-hoo! Can you two get a move on? Playing guard is getting pretty boring. Just another minute. We've got it under control, John. Fine. But we've got a job to do, remember? Let's just see what this is all about.
This might hold the black site location. on button. <sighs> Encrypted. Just like the laptop. There must be something nearby we can use. Gotta be a password, right? It's what we came here for. It's at least worth a try. Riddles. <laughs> a little on the nose, don't you think? USB drive. Yeah, I think it might be a trap. Maybe. But we already made it past the line of security, so... Maybe not. Your certainty is assuring. Here we go. Decryptor detected. Accessing Sanctus Project Lotus files. Project Lotus. Sanctus. Retinal scan required. Uh, shit. I haven't made the goggles yet. Retinal scan. Timeout. Hephaestus protocol detected. The decryptor! You know what Sanctus is, don't you? I heard stories on jobs. Best I can piece together, they're a group up to... No good is generous. They're scary. Great. One thing's for sure. We're not getting any more info off that thing. Well, there's always Riddler's laptop. Harley still has it. The decryptor probably works with that as well. Everything okay down there? Send the lift back up. I should have come back sooner and reeled Riddler in, but I didn't. Knowing he was tangled up with Sanctus, and what he did to Lucius. This is my fault. My mess to clean up. By yourself? I can help. Why? Do I look like I need your help? You don't have the code to do what needs to be done here, Bruce. You want to do this your way? You'll have to beat me to it. What are you doing? Balancing the scales. You are not leaving here with that. Oh, honey. I'm already gone. Forceful as always. <laughs> Bye, Bruce. It's been fun. Getting rusty. You haven't gotten past me yet. Slow down a bit. You're coming out blurry. I forgot how 
how skilled you are with your hands. That's one way to get her to notice you. Move, John. Harley's laptop for myself, and I'm finishing this my way. <clears throat> Harley's laptop, huh? You and I, we're going to talk. Somewhere else. So, John, about the laptop, um... You know, I'm the first guy who resort to stealing from anyone, anyone but her. But in a way, that almost makes it more enticing. But in another way, maybe I tell her, getting her good graces. Maybe I will. Maybe I'll do just that. Then she'd remember my name has an H in it. Because we're friends, John, this is between us. Oh, we are friends, we are. But Harley's... Harley? I don't know, Bruce. I'm torn here. Just thinking about her makes me feel like I'm floating. She's the most intriguing creature ever to grace me with a demeaning insult. Which is great, don't, don't get me wrong. I, I want more, Bruce. Like you and Catwoman. I'm only a little ashamed to say that dance had my pulse pounding. What's your relationship with her? Your real one? Not much to tell. She's just another criminal, John. She's only out for herself. Oh, you must be blind then, Bruce. I told you, I'm a watcher. I'm watching her. Uh, she sees something in you. Uh, if only Harley saw me. Like, really saw me. The world's a crazy place, isn't it? I want Harley, and you want the laptop. Maybe we can come to an arrangement. I help you with Harley. <laughs> <laughs> I see. You're up to bat then, Wayne. What did you do to make Catwoman purr? How can I get that with Harley? You just need to be genuine. You're special, John. She just needs to see that. So, be myself. I hear that a lot, but... How can I be myself if I don't really know who that is yet? How did you know who you are, Bruce? I've always known who I am. Something happened early on that... that made me what I am today. Oh, I hope a moment like that finds me soon. It must be great to be who you're supposed to be. Feel someone a few layers deep, pacing like an animal in a cage, just looking for something to start it. The prison break. Hey, that's who you really are. You shouldn't suppress it. But I, I'm 
quite scrambled. Hey, that's what I like about you. And I bet that's what Harley will like too. How does that even work? Bond with her. Lend a hand with a problem she has. I don't know, Bruce. I have a tough time just talking to her. Oh, I've got an idea. Let's play pretend. Uh, what? You'll be Harley. Say something Harley would say. Bane is such a loser. Yeah? What are you gonna do to him? Snuff out his light. I don't know what she would say. <laughs> I'd kill for some front row seats to that. Okay, now say something uh, date-like. Like we're out painting the town red. Hi, John. I like hiking. Do you like the outdoors? Oh, you love me! So, so what do you think? Pretty good, right? That was perfect, John. Why did you think you couldn't do this? Really? I guess I'm just a natural lady killer. Okay, hit me. Another. What was your favorite thing about Arkham Puddin? For me, it was Sloppy Joe Fridays. Bruce! This is just uncanny! Okay, okay, here we go. I enjoyed... the lights. They had a hum to them. Felt like a blanket. Fuzzy, even. I miss that on the outside. It, it doesn't feel as real here, you know? Out here, chaos seems to rule the day. It's loud and uneven. But you, Harley, you thrive on it. I could learn from that because I thrive on you. You're my light outside of Arkham. It's beautiful, John. She'll be eating out of your hand in no time. Y you think? I, I don't know. It, it felt weird to say. I really think I'm getting the hang of this. I'll start the next one. Your face has all the adequate face-like qualities one looks for in, uh, in a face. Harley, I lobbed you a perfect pitch. You gonna swing or what? John, sorry, something just came up. Uh, it's business. I have to run. So soon? It's fine. A for effort, Bruce. I guess I won't go tattling to Harley. So, will you help me get the laptop? Gosh, Bruce. We are friends, and you're right about that. And, uh, our talk really got me fired up to find myself. My true self. Plus, your Harley is spot on. Drive a hard bargain, mister. Wait. Jeez. <laughs> okay, let me mull over the logistics. But I'm in. Meet me back at the subway when you're done with your business. And because we're pals, coffee's on my dime. Bruce? Expecting Waller. Sorry to disappoint. So, what happened? Where were you? What do you mean? The agency convoy? All those freaks were in one place and you decide not to show? No, I didn't like you. You don't take time off. So what kept you? I was there, Jim. You just didn't see me. Oh, yeah? Well, you let him get away pretty easily. I guess I can't really talk. We got there late. Uh, by then it was just Quinn. She still hospitalized a dozen good cops, then gave us a slip. Is that all? Uh, no. No, I... Uh, I got a favor to ask. 
Lucius Fox. I know he was your friend, and I don't mean to speak ill of the dead. But I think he might have been up to some shady stuff before Riddler's attack on Wayne Tower. He might not have been the man you thought. Not entirely. Think carefully about your next words, Jim. I've been thinking about him since the moment I threw that switch. Riddler had it out for Lucius Fox, and I'm sure there's something more. The way you're pushing back on this only confirms that. Waller shut down any investigation into the circumstances surrounding his death. And that means something stinks in Denmark. He could follow that stench all the way to Fox's employer. Look, just how much do you really know about Bruce Wayne? I see where you're going with this, but you're on the wrong trail. Bruce Wayne is helping you. Uh, well, if he's helping us, he has a real funny way of doing it. At first, I thought Fox was at the center of it all. But there's a hell of a lot more. A Wayne Enterprises security guard comes to GCPD saying he was assaulted by Harley Quinn and her gang. And who was leading her around like a pet? Bruce Wayne. Then I checked the video recordings. Someone did an amateur job covering up the security footage. Files were replaced, time unaccounted for, sloppy. And strike three? One of my officers gets bashed in the head while he goes into Riddler's old workshop. Bruce Wayne is dirty and he's dangerous. Waller knows all of this happened too, and she refuses to let me move on it. So I need you to bring him in. That's the favor. I can't do it, but you can. I know what it looks like, Gordon, but Wayne isn't dirty. You're wrong, you know. His whole thing, it doesn't add up. Gotham's safety is slipping out from under me and I can't stand it! I know your friend Catwoman's in town. Got a rap sheet that'll put her away for life. Maybe I can't move on Bruce Wayne, but I can move on her. I should have done this a year ago. I can't ask you to break the law, Jen. Uh, don't make me laugh. As soon as I get back to the office, I'm sending out a task force after her. And you, you better not tell her we're coming. It sounds like he's on a ball path. If I warn Selina and she gets away, Gordon and the police will blame me. But if I don't, I put her in danger. Don't forget that you're both after that laptop. Gordon might be your best chance to slow her down. Unfortunately, we're running out of time. It's my fault Gordon is like this. I want to tell him everything, but I can't. Secrets poison relationships, Bruce. But to protect this city, to protect yourself, he can't know. You know, Miss Kyle is going to run sooner or later. It's her nature. How much can you really trust her as an ally? I know how you feel about her. Make certain you aren't letting that cloud your judgment. She already betrayed me back at the workshop. Yes, Catwoman's motives will always be suspect. You know what must be done. Save it. Death? How dare she? 
It's a symbol of justice, like the little hammers judges use. You think I don't know that, the Batman? I've had it since I was a baby. I can help, Jim. I have sharp batarangs. No! This is my burden to bear. I need one final night with my best facial feature. Alone. What if I grew a mustache for you? Batman! Hi! Uh, hello! So, uh, John. My name's John. John Doe. You don't know me. Well, we actually did cross paths once, but, uh... What did you overhear? I, I didn't hear anything. I just got here, I swear. Oh, this is just... What a pleasure. So nice to finally meet you. It's just a handshake. Nice to meet you, John. Wow, quite a grip you've got there. You must squeeze a stress ball a lot. I've been waiting over a year for that moment. I'm just such a huge fan of yours. And here you are, in the flesh. <laughs> I'm looking for mentors, role models. I've come across a few good candidates. You're, you're Batman. <laughs> I don't take on students. Now hold on. Before you accept, here's what I bring to the table. I can get you Riddler's laptop. All his secrets right there. And the gang who attacked the convoy. They needed to pull off a big score. The point. So what if I steal it from Harley Quinn, no less? Give it to you. But, uh, and, and, this is, and this is a big but. I need you to promise nothing bad will happen to Harley. I mean, letting one criminal slip through the cracks every once in a while can't be the worst thing. That depends on what she does. If she hurts innocence, then I stop her. Well, that's... You really... This is what dedication looks like, huh? But if I get the laptop, uh, there is no score, so win-win. Now, now, when you're on the job, what's the preferred method of extracting a target? Always repelling in, or explosives as a distraction, or... You know what? I'll wing it. If I were you, I'd get a friend to help. That's a great idea! I hope Bruce is there. He'd do anything for me. Oh, one last thing! <laughs> I collect these. They mean a lot to me. Oh, we look so cool. I mean, you're cool. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not usually cool, but next to you I look cool. Oh, this is gonna look great on my wall. Thank you. Laptop. Behind the stack deck. I'll be there. Promise. Hope to die. You won't be disappointed. You speak, but all I hear are lies! Dishonor yourself, Timothy. If you are the rat, then wear it proud. I would have respect for that, and with respect comes mercy. Greetings, Wayne. Come with me. As a fellow apostle of technology, I thought you might appreciate this. Vane and I were acquiring components for a device I'll need once we get to the black site. Device? Yes, an ice explosive for the fire failsafe we anticipate encountering. That isn't the impressive detail. As we ran into interference, I determined I would be more efficient if I made smaller versions and employed them as projectiles. Who were they? Hindrances. As you can see, it's been wildly successful. Impressive science freeze. You'll notice I don't do anything ineffectually, Mr. Wayne. 
Hear that, Freeze? Wayne, he's cut out for this life after all, huh? <laughs> yes, I thought as much after he took a pipe to one of my boys. <laughs> one more time, my friend. Why did an alarm go off when it was your job to ensure it didn't? Vane, come on. I, I slipped up. Dangerous time to make a mistake when you knew I was looking for a mole. You're trying to slow us down! No! Look, I want to get paid just like you. I got mouths to feed. Man. When the police arrived, you were nowhere to be found! I... You know I'm no traitor. I stood up for you, remember? Come on, man. We have to stand together on this. Just think. Remember? Yeah, sure. Pretty bold move. Good, yeah, yeah! Now, now why, why would I do that if I was dirty? I'd have thrown you to the wolves to cover my ass, right? Oh, a deft turn, but it's not enough to save you. In fact, your awareness of how to deceive only creates more suspicion. What the hell is going no, on no, here? No, 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 no! Merely plugging the leak. God damn it, Bane. You run in your own investigation? You gonna get little business cards printed that say Detective Bane now? Why are you complaining? I didn't get a chance to grill the guy. I'm a trained psychiatrist. What are you? A side of beef with a hunch? I'll find the rat, and I'll deal with it. You can't be trusted to run your men anymore. They're mine now. Got Yours? It? <laughs> I freed them from Santa Prisca! You just killed one. I only shot him. <laughs> Who do you think wins that recruitment war? They won't follow you. What do you want, John? Right. The laptop. This seems like the perfect time. You don't know for sure it was him. So now what? They know the cost. I value loyalty above all else. You know who's gonna have a tough time being loyal now? Th that guy. Just keep her busy. I have to sneak into her office to get it. Then uh, it's all yours. For my old buddy Bruce, and only you. I promise. Sound like a plan. Up top. Yes, that was a good one. Hey, you two. What's going on with you guys? Harley, what a surprise! Did you guys get me a black site location or not? The answer better be yes, Harley. We didn't find the location to the black site yet. But, but we did uncover the code name for whatever you're after. Pro Project Lotus, ringing bells. Well, what is Pro Project Lotus? What, what do you want? Shouldn't you be informing your men they work for me now? You? You can't even keep these two from colluding. Kevin? Are you kidding me? He's loyal to a fault. I, I'm loyal, Harley. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I want, want to be, because I'm being myself. myself. The mole, the mole, Bane's man, you, you, maybe, possibly, can't handle it. I went alone. I have a problem, and I want to help. You, you time out. Need to talk. <laughs> Bruce, Bruce, Bruce. This here is one of my favorite toys. Helps me make boring things and into pretty things. Can you be a small guy and guess another one of my favorite toys? Come, come.
Come on. You can do it. You mean you your hammer? <laughs> but good yes. guess. But, but uh, no. It's, it's John. You, you talk like it a little, little bit too close to school comfort. So, so I'm making a new rule. Hands or what? So don't play with my toys, or I'll have to shoot them to these places. Alpha is a super for drop off. Of course, most of your accomplishments are successful. Looks like like I'm on my way to be out now. Updating my look. I'm your man on the street. Literally. Hmm. 
Selena. I had nowhere else to go. I guess I was a fool for thinking I'd be safe here. Get the hell out of my house. This was as far as I could get, given my situation. <sighs> Maybe we should just start from the beginning. What happened? I'm glad you're here, Bruce. Miss Kyle is injured. I've dressed the wound as best I can. I trust you told him about your motorcycle accident? I was just about to. Hope you don't mind me tending to her wounds. I couldn't turn her away. Not in her condition. You let a wanted criminal into our house. How could you? What was I supposed to do? Let her bleed to death on the front lawn? Give us a minute, would you, Al? You don't have to be such a jerk to him, Bruce. I'm pretty sure he's on the verge of a nervous breakdown. And you don't want to be the one who pushes him over the edge. Alfred will be fine. He's been on my side through a lot more than this. Then I'm surprised you don't see it. He's slipping. Whoa, what are you doing? Relax. I'm just changing out the bandage. Be a doll and hand me a clean piece of gauze. Been through two dressings already. Guess it could have been worse. There. Good as new. So, do you want to tell me what really happened? We both know you didn't get this from a motorcycle accident. I was ambushed by your friend Gordon tonight. Thought you knew. You and Gordon are so tight. He must have mentioned he was coming after me. Gordon did what he had to. He's a good man. A good officer. So you did know. Why didn't you warn me? I know we haven't always seen eye to eye, it's just... I never thought you would give me up. Not to the cops. I tried, but you ran out and wouldn't listen. And in return, I get life in prison? I guess I can't blame you. I haven't exactly given you a whole lot of reasons to trust me. But I never expected you to turn on me like that. Listen. This little game we play, you know I've always enjoyed it. The tit for tat. It's fun. But tonight, you've taken it too far. Way too far. Is that why you came here? To guilt trip me? No. I came for Harley's laptop. Well, why is the laptop so important to you? I wanted to get payback for Riddler. On my own terms. I let my temper get the best of me. But this is bigger than my vendetta. I want to find that black site. Before they do. The laptop is useless without Riddler's decryptor. Good thing I brought it then. You have the goggles too? Not so fast. What are you offering me in return? You know when it comes to me, nothing is for free. You give me the decryptor and we will crack this code together. I promise. Okay. I'll give it to you. But on one condition. What do you want from me, Selena? I want you to admit that you need my help. I want you to say, Selena, I need you. I can't do this without you. Say it and it's yours. You're the one who needs me. Is that so? You wouldn't be here if you didn't. Maybe you're right. Hey, that wasn't a very nice thing to do.
Selena. Oh my god! Miss Kyle! It's okay, Alfred. I was just leaving. Miss Kyle came to you injured, vulnerable, looking for help. And all you did was hurt her. This house is supposed to be a place of safety, a sanctuary. I'm really not in the mood, Alfred. You have the laptop? And the glasses we need to get past the encryption. I can't blame you for keeping Ms. Kyle at arm's length. Uh, not after the way things ended between you last year. Even so, I just wonder, perhaps she might not be the worst thing for you. She may not be the most savory individual, she certainly is capable, and right now, capable is what we need. Selena thinks she can charm her way through life. I'm done playing that game. You're clearly more than a toy to her. At least, that's how it looks from the outside. Why don't we keep our minds on Riddler's laptop? It was just a thought. Decryptor detected. Accessing Sanctus Project Lotus files. Retinal scan required. Let's try this again. Access granted. It appears it'll take a moment to scan for viruses and other safeguards. If you have a second, I have something to show you. useful for many different applications, but especially effective when you need to make that dramatic entrance. I finished up a new feature for your contacts. Lucius nearly completed it before. But, well, I've been fiddling with it to keep myself occupied. Uh, at any
rate, your contacts now have the capability to detect heat signatures. Cold, too, because, well, with Mr. Freeze, you never know. Thanks. I'm sure it'll come in handy. It's done. Sounds like the laptop is safe. data. Patient 843. 10 milligram injection at 0.01% solution. <laughs> Patient 844. 10 milligram injection at 0.015% solution. Is this a medical facility or a prison? We have to find what they were giving those test subjects. Voices, schematics, design notes. Riddler must have been talking about the location of the black side. His obsession with data left us an incredibly thorough paper trail. Look, manifest. Bodhi Spa. Strange place for delivery of virus incubators. This must be what Riddler means by hiding in plain sight. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Some kind of viral agent from the looks of things. A biological weapon. This is what Harley wants. Agency. My God, Bruce. We cannot let that virus fall into the hands of those maniacs. I will stop them now. How? Lucius is gone, Gordon doesn't trust us, and Selina, well, you certainly made sure she won't be coming to your aid. You keep distancing yourself. You need more support than just this old soldier. We're completely isolated. How are you supposed to deal with a threat this big without allies? I don't need help from anybody. If you really believe that, you're blind. You don't do this alone. So long as I live, you never will. I have the location of the black side. I need to get in there before Riddler's gang or the police do. Despite my reservations about her, I think it's time to reach out to Miss Waller. What do I owe the pleasure of this call? The agency was working on a virus with human test subjects. Bruce, what on earth? I just saw it with my own eyes. How do you... Is that what Quinn's after? Yes. I found the black site. Hiding in the middle of Gotham at the Bodhi Spa. Okay. Okay. I promise we'll get to the bottom of this. But I need you to trust me. Meet me at Wayne Tower in 15. Tiffany, what are you doing here? Running late today? I expected you earlier. I needed to talk to you, but... You only have yourself to blame for this. Hands behind your back! On the floor, now! On the floor! Now, now! Bruce Wayne, you're under arrest for armed robbery, murder, and criminal conspiracy to commit a terrorist act. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. Take your hands off me before I... Uh, shut your mouth and stay down! 
Uh, thanks for the call, Miss Fox. You've done a good thing today. I look to you for answers, for comfort after my father's death. Instead, you're running with a new crowd. Criminals? I hope you understand why I had to do this. It makes me question everything you've told me my entire life. I don't get it. Having me arrested is completely absurd. Knowing what I know, it'd be absurd if you went free. What in the... Director Waller? Uncuff Mr. Wayne right now, or you'll spend the rest of your life as a meter maid. Mr. Wayne is under agency protection, and you know it! What? You've known it for some time. Waller and the agency? They're not always gonna be around to save you, Wayne. One day, you're gonna run out of favors to call in. And when you do, there'll be hell to pay. I'm not a criminal, Gordon. Save Officers, it. please! I... He's involved! He belongs in a cell! This is neither your concern or your purview. Go home, Gordon. You're done here. The hell I will! If I were you, I'd be very careful with my next words. And if I were you, I'd stop interfering with GCPD business. This is my city! Not anymore. You're so far out of line, you can't see the truth. You're dismissed. Excuse me? You tested me. This is what happens. Damn it, Waller! You can't do this! It's well within my power, and you know it. Waller! Waller, Gordon is a good cop. He's a good man. Don't do this. Not from you. It's the last straw. I won't allow anyone to question my authority. This is strictly professional. Oh, sure. Time to go, Jim. We'll make sure Gordon leaves, and be right outside. When you're ready. I apologize for everything. Calling the cops was a bit much. Well, you wanted a chance to talk to me, so here it is. Talk. I just... I don't understand how you got tied up in all this. The agency? If I had known you were... What are you doing with them? Please, just tell me, Bruce. It's classified. I'm sorry, Tiff. I can't say. I guess I understand. Whatever this is. Whatever you're doing. I see now, though. This is why he's dead. He was involved in whatever you're doing. This work you're doing seems incredibly dangerous. But there's something I don't get. Why you? I mean, no offense, but you're just... Bruce. I'm Batman. You're Batman. The Batman. Come on. Got something to show you. Hey, Bruce. Wanted to show you a preview of your new bat suit. I know you and Alfred are still on your well-deserved retreat, but I couldn't help myself. Dad. I'll upload the specs to your private server. All right. Hope you guys are enjoying yourselves. I'll see you soon. It was hard to believe, but hearing it from him... Your dad was a hero. Your dad believed the city deserved better. He believed in me. And to think I gave him lip for missing dinner sometimes. With dad gone, maybe I can still help, if... Batman is interested. It's the least I can do. And I know my dad would be proud. Well, let's not 
get out of ourselves. The situation I'm in, it's too dangerous for you. I have to do this on my own. I'll be here if you need me, Bruce. Okay, I need to digest. Sorry for everything earlier, but thank you for trusting me with this. I'm only saying we might be pushing him too hard. He's capable and he knows how to cover his tracks. Our only path forward is through Wayne. <clears throat> oh, let's get to it then. I know you have some questions. A few. Care to explain why the videos I saw said this virus was an agency experiment? Years ago, I was brought in to rectify the agency's past mistakes. Or, failing that, to cover them up. One mess in particular dealt with black ops experiments. Human subjects. The kind of amoral science that makes your skin crawl. Sanctus. They were a division that was shut down for good, long before either of us joined. But evidently, they went underground. This is our worst-case scenario. With Sanctus off the leash, this research poses a global threat. If I'd known where they set up their den, I would have taken them out years ago. If you want them taken out, now's your chance. We know right where they are. It's not that simple. Sanctus was dangerous then. They're certainly worse now. This whole situation, it's given me an idea. I can't put an agent within a thousand yards of that place without them starting a war or blowing up the entire block just to cover their tracks. We know it's tricky, but leading Harley and her gang into Sanctus might allow the two problems to take care of themselves. They have Riddler's info. They have a way in. And you're undercover with them. At least with Sanctus and the Pact at each other's throats, the Agency can act quickly, clean up, and minimize casualties. It's unorthodox, but a strike like this will keep damage from spilling onto Gotham streets. Makes sense. Why endanger anyone else when I have my own personal wrecking crew? My thoughts, exactly. Look, for now, just go and check this place out. Right now, as yourself. You don't want them to know Batman is on their tail. I bet you're the type of guy who has some expensive surveillance equipment. We have your back, Bruce. We'll be right behind you. Keep me in the loop so I know what my team and I might be facing when it goes down. Defenses, security, whatever. Their lives are in your hands, Bruce. As well as the fate of this city. I know you might have reservations about working with Harley and her crew like this. Sometimes you have to use bad people to do good things. I think so. While you were at the office, I did some basic online research on the Bodhi Spa. Excellent. What's the verdict? According to reviews, it truly seems to be a fully functioning business. Uh, not just a front. Couldn't tell from the service entrance. They offer rather popular high-end massages and have an active social media feed. It's a 24-hour business, Bruce. There are customers going in and out at all times. They have no idea what's coming for them. There's no way to tell until I get in there. I'll proceed with caution. Initiate the feed of my contacts to Waller. Let her know I'm here. At once. I need to see what we're up against. Good idea. Remember, you're able to toggle the thermal imaging in your lenses. I'm signing off while you speak with Director Waller. Be careful. Thanks, so. Al. Waller? On the line, Bruce. I'm here. I'll let you know if I find anything interesting. Caution is key, Bruce. This situation is a spark away from a wildfire. I'll keep that in mind. That access door is connected to the spa. There are still traces of heat signatures. 
Someone was here recently. Maybe guards. That appears to just be a patron. security panel inside the building. It could trigger an alarm system of some kind. If I can hit that before they suspect what I'm really here for. They'll be blind and helpless. Perfect for my people. You just saved a few agents' lives, Bruce. Looks like we have a receptionist behind the front desk. She's hardly anything to worry about. All too easy to hide a gun under that desk. Huh. Project Lotus. This is definitely the place. Bodhi Spa. Good work, Bruce. They weren't exactly being subtle. lab must be underground. Sanctus has been in the middle of Gotham this entire time. They burrow under your skin and eat you from the inside out. This is why I'm willing to let these criminals be the tip of the spear. Dangerous and expendable. My favorite adjectives. That's some top-notch field work, Bruce. I know being undercover has been tough, but you just need to maintain it a little longer. If you don't get inside with those maniacs, we're going to have a pandemic on our hands. Waller, I need to go. Now why would a billionaire be skulking around in a filthy alley? Carefully inspecting every detail. Almost as if performing reconnaissance. I could ask you the same. Oh, I'm not skulking. I have a very deliberate purpose. My Bane, have you been spying on me? Spying? No. I've only been keeping an eye on you. That's the same thing. I heard that GCPD paid you a visit at your office, so I swung by to see if you might be in need of some aid. Innocent as that. Then, something about the look on your face as you left. So, determined. Yes. I had a sense you would lead me to something interesting. Project Lotus. This is the secret you and Harley had. Where are we, Bruce? What is this place? And do your best to be honest. This is it. The black site Riddler wanted to hit. So this is what Harley was trying to keep secret. She didn't know. Strange that you're here after a run-in with GCPD. 
in an alleyway with the other rats. Finding you in this duplicitous position while we have a mole problem. Well, it does not look good for you, my friend. When you wake up, you can tell Harley that you led me right to her conspiracy. Wake up! Rise and shine. you're about to face, Wayne. You did the right thing, telling me about the Black Site. But there's still something about you that gives me pause. Something that casts a shadow over your heart. Harley wanted to spearhead the hunt for the mole. This will be her chance. So, be thoughtful with your words in there. They could be your last. I'm not scared. <laughs> False bravery would not save you, Wayne. What is it now, Wayne? The rat has been uncovered. Wayne was right under your nose. I tracked Wayne to the location of the black site. And if he had I sent Wayne to scout it, so lower your damn voice. It was the final piece of the puzzle, and now we got it. Go get your boys ready. We move on the site ASAP. And don't worry your pretty little head about our rat problem. I got it covered. And Bane, tell Freeze to get one of them popsicle makers ready. You're not going anywhere. You're in here. With me. Thanks for backing me up. Don't mention it. Can't have him stepping on my turf, you know? I said I'd find the rats. And I will. Your father. He was a hard man, right? Someone lied to him. Betrayed him. He ended them. Think he was onto something with that idea? Show no mercy? Take no apologies? You need to keep your people in line. Sometimes that means making hard choices. <laughs> such a pretty way of saying killing a person. And taking you for such a ruthless fella. You are who I think you are, Bruce. Who do you think I am? A man out to prove to the underworld he's just as bad as his dear departed dad. Or there are more to the story I should know. Hidden depths? Secrets you don't want me to see. I also enjoy long walks on the beach. Hmm. <laughs> You're funny. Must have gotten that from your mother's side. You know, my dad could be a funny guy, too. And they all fell down to the deep to drown to the dark to drown he used to sing that to me my dad made me feel safe like nothing could hurt me that's kind of a disturbing song well my dad was kind of a disturbing fella now he's just a glimmer in a maggot's belly same as we'll all be someday. In fact, you being like my dad, that's why I got such a soft spot for you. Oh, you do? You found me the black site, didn't you? Plus, you're not a bad guy. I mean, you're rotten like the rest of us. But, you actually care for some people. Like that girl. What's her face, uh... Brittany? No. Tiffany. You remember? Early twenties, fresh-faced and optimistic. 
No? No, I think it was Brittany. Sorry, I barely know her. <laughs> You're cute when you're friends. You know that? I don't know if she's your friend or mortal enemy, but I know you care about her at least a little. Yeah, friends are great. Except when you have to lose them. Laptop's gone. What are you? Yeah, Shaka. We have a turncoat. I've interviewed just about everyone in the place. Except maybe one. Or two. So gosh, that only leaves the two people I haven't cleared. You and Captain. Maybe it was the guy who Bane gave the hamburger face. But weirdest thing, the laptop went missing after that. Well, you seem to have made up your mind already. I guess one of us has to be the mole. But you've already cleared me. Trying to make me second guess myself ain't gonna work, sweetie. Nice try, though. John, get in here! When I told Puddin I narrowed it down to you two, he begged me to let him interrogate you. I gave him some pointers, and now this is his chance. Hi, Bruce. You potential rat. Have at it, John. Harley, uh, uh, do you mind? Can't learn to ride with training wheels on forever, you know? I'll be right outside. Admit it, you rat scum! You're the... the rat! <clears throat> Sorry, I have to make it sound good. Do it again. What? Hit me again. You're hitting him already. I'll let it play. <sighs> I never wanted it to come to this. But we both know what has to be done. Catwoman has to take the fall. Think about it, Bruce. Harley's gonna kill that Tiffany girl if it's you. Okay, John. That's what we'll do. What? Really? you to see it that fast. Okay, 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 this is good. I'm calling her back in. Harley, we're done. Puddin, you might have surpassed the teacher. That was record time. Who are we hanging out to dry? Go ahead, Bruce. Tell her what you told me. Come on. Go ahead, Bruce. It's okay. It was Catwoman. She took your laptop. How do you know? Uh, sh she took a phone call at Riddler's. Bruce overheard her talking about it. I understand, Bruce. I'm disappointed, too. So much for the solidarity of sisterhood. <laughs> and here I was, starting to be a cat person. I knew you had it in you, John. We are gonna do terrible things together. Like... In a cat. What are you doing? Did you think I was just gonna let her go or something? That freaking chance. She's gonna get turned into one of Freeze's popsicles. I know cats don't like water, but how do they feel about ice? Fine. Do what you gotta do. Ugh, you asshole! Wow, that was cold. <laughs> Guess she should get used to it. We're ready to move. Good. This'll just take a second. Get her inside. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen that look in your eyes before. On other men, just before they get themselves killed. Come on! Just throw her in one of Riddler's...
endless murder boxes. We have a black site to raid. Come on, Bruce. Time to raise some hell. 